here we are with summertime rendering episode 23 so yeah if you like what you see leave a like subscribe or comment let me know what do you think and with that let's get to the episode What the fuck? Wow. So he can steal her eye, but not Shimpei's. Ooh! You know scare. What the fuck? <clears throat> this is getting really weird. Didn't he just kill Heine by slicing her in half? Or maybe just open to the real shadow body, whatever. I don't know, man. God damn. <laughs> He's like, oh damn.
Did they went back in time or some shit? What the fuck? The, dis the distorted, <clears throat> distorted world? No. I guess he's on water, but the water is not really water. <clears throat> now we can run with this lag. Moment ago, oh shit, I can't move my leg. No, oh, let's run. And now he can't run again. I wonder, will this be the last three episodes and that's how they wrap it up in this world here? What the fuck? She's my little sister. Someone's singing? Is this Heine, maybe? <clears throat> Fuck. 
fuck the ball. <laughs> Follow the ball. This one shot, he had the shotgun on his shoulder, <laughs> not against the shoulder, on top of it. Welcome to the Shadow Realm. <laughs> Are they talking in reverse? <clears throat> Don't mind me, just coming through. Tiny, maybe? She gets touchy. Uh oh. The good part and the bad part, right? What I think is interesting the original Heine, the non shadow version, the human one. I think it looks similar to Ryunosuke, right? And uh, Nagomo. Like, dark hair, purple eyes, I think. Yeah, that clearly must be the good one, because she's in white. <laughs> you have to symbolize it. We fuck him up. He can't loop, your nose can't look into the future.
What? That what he wants? World destruction? <clears throat> what the fuck? We are back in war? Is she manipulating this world right now to bump them away? <clears throat> he has hair now? Oh. Man, this is fucked up. <laughs> I guess she didn't make the remembered. <clears throat> Just using her. Oh boy. <laughs> In two blows. And she's burning up there in Chile? Holy shit. <laughs> oh. 
she's running on the bombs. <laughs> Ah, oh, goddamn it. She said two blows. I guess it was one. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. When he has his mud on, there's nothing inside, really. <laughs> oh, she hadn't. She had something. Her hair. Oh, she's hacking the real one. Hack, hack, motherfucker. Oh, she erased the memory. Ooh. How? How is he in the real world? Okay, that was the episode. Let me know what you think. But yeah, quite weird. At the beginning, he it seems like he cut Hiroko in half, like Aine, whatever you want to call her. But that didn't kill her. It opened the gates, portal, whatever, to her home world where she wants to go or whatever uh, inside herself. I don't know, man. Oh boy. <clears throat> and then yeah. I guess the most important part here right now is to not go over everything. Um, for some reason, Shida is in the real world. And that's why we can't really fight him in this world. Because here he is. I mean, we can. We just have to erase his whole body. So that he's gone, basically, in this world. Because he can't recover right now, it seems like. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, we also found like the real Aine. The good side, not the bad side. While well, Shida has basically the bad side with him to use it, to manipulate it. Um, yeah. How is he in the real world? We know there was like two which both died. One got killed by Mio by a stab in the head. And the other one got killed way earlier. So there is a third one that went into this world. We saw it. And now there is another one. Or do they want to explain it like one of the two that already got killed survived somehow? So it gets kind of weird. How many shields are there? <laughs> what the fuck is going on? Uh, and yeah, now we can control this shield in this world from the real world somehow. However, he can do that. I, I have to say, I like this anime. It looks good, it's interesting and all that stuff. But like the last few episodes, I think with episode 18 it started, where there's so much weird shit going on that all the logic, where you could before be like, oh yeah, this is logic, that makes sense, and you can think about it and theorize about it, and you could come up with shit and be like, okay, yeah, that makes sense. Since episode 18, it started where it's like, what the fuck is going on? That makes no sense. What the fuck? And it's like, all the logic gets thrown out of the window. 
which were basically started with Shinpei being like after the night of sleep, oh look the time limit has not extended much so I have a few loops left then he dies one time and he's immediately at the edge and has only like this one loop left and if he loops again he's dead and a few hours later just like maybe one or two hours later like he said after like I don't know probably 10 plus hours of surviving and not looping he said oh I have more loops left now then he dies one time and like one or two hours later where he was before at the edge one or two hours later he's like oh I can loop again and it happened multiple times now that he is like oh I have like no more leeway I'm at the edge and in the last few episodes it's happened over and over again where he's like I just came back from a loop not much time has passed let's loop again this whole edge thing and falling off it if he loops too much and having no no time anymore really and no leeway is completely out of the window <laughs> and that's what basically started this whole it makes no sense anymore thing um and yeah there is some other stuff that was going on that didn't make much sense um but yeah like i said i still it's still interesting i want to see where how it goes right how it ends and everything but like this whole part about the anime that i like that you can like theorize about it and come up with stuff that maybe might happen that makes sense and stuff feels like it's completely out of the window by now <laughs> and it's like yeah at this point it's just we watch it to enjoy it but the whole part about it where you can think about it and come up with stuff is like out of the window i mean you can still think about it and come up with stuff but it's like so unpredictable at this point and not based on any logic at all that the world that the anime before established basically that it's like yeah i don't know what the fuck is going on anymore i just watch it and see how it goes how it ends and we will see right <laughs> which is a bit sad because i like the part that it's like that you could like theorize about stuff and yeah that's not really the case anymore because like i said i could do it but at this point anything could happen really and it's like yeah it feels like not worth it to really theorize about it anymore because there's only like episode 24 and 25 left now so yeah we will see how it goes right if there will be the ultimate happy end maybe there will be the ultimate happy end where every where they can turn back time and do everything perfectly right and then every everyone will be alive or maybe it's like nagumo keeps being dead they can't reverse that part and maybe the shadows that are still living like mio and ushio maybe they will be alive after, after everything is done because maybe the good heine can stick around and can be kept alive because she's not evil or maybe all the shadows just disappear at the end i don't know we will see but yeah i don't know we will see like i said we will see we just have to two more episodes and then we get the conclusion and i think i've heard that someone said that the last three episodes so this episode the next episode and the episode after that are a bit different from the original apparently i've heard if that's true i don't know that's what i've heard and if that's true then I guess I will maybe read the end of the manga and see what's different but if everything else before that is basically what the manga is about and how the manga did things then be yeah, okay but yeah like I said we will see um interesting episode bit confusing episode and oh yeah and also like Ushio seems to be like fainted now maybe because too much stress suddenly I don't know she could do before she could do so much and she never passed out or something now she is like passed out for some reason we will see how that goes but yeah we will see <laughs> that's i guess that's all i have to say right now so yeah if you like what you saw leave a like subscribe or comment let me know what you think it would say thanks for watching until next time bye bye